Hey everyone, today we are going to create some awesome mist and fog in Unreal Engine. Stick around until the end so you don't miss this cool technique. Let's get started. So before starting the tutorial, I have learned this technique from Mr. 3D Dev. So thanks to him to sharing us this cool technique. Now to start off in Unreal Engine, I have created this simple environment to show you how the fog will gonna look like. So first open the content browser by holding Ctrl and press space like that. Now here I'm gonna create a new folder like fog material. And in the folder I'm gonna create a new material. Right click and in material click on this material right here. I'm gonna name it M underscore fog. Put this material editor tab right here and zoom in. By holding the right mouse button you can navigate in the material editor. Now here in material editor, just select this node and change the blend mode from opaque to translucent like that. After that, we're going to add some nodes. Now to add nodes in material editor, just right click and search gradient exponential like that. We're going to add this uh, radial gradient exponential. After that, hold M and press left mouse button like that to add multiply node. You can also add it uh, from here if you type multiply right here. After adding the multiply, let's just plug the exponential gradient in base color and also in A section of multiply. And plug the multiply in opacity like that. Now right here we're gonna add depth fade. Right here. Now plug the depth fade in B section of multiply. Now to control the opacity and fade distance of this depth fade, we are gonna add some parameters. Now to add parameters, hold S and press left mouse button like that. I am gonna name it opacity and again hold S and press left mouse button and I am gonna name it fade distance like that and put the default value something like 1 and plug them like that now you can see we have this simple fog right here if you want to see in the real world just add a plane right here in the shapes add plane I'm gonna scale it to like something 300 Rotate it like that. Now before applying the material to the plane, we need to create a first material instance. Just right click on this material and create material instance. The reason we have created this material instance is that we can control the opacity and fade distance from here without going into material editor. Now to apply the material, just select the material instance like that and also select the plane. Now in the details panels of this plane, you can see the material right here. Just click on this arrow right here. Now as you can see we have this cool looking fog sheet right here. Now you might notice these hard edges on the surface. We can easily fix that. Just double click on material instance. Increase the fade distance like that. As you can see. You can also increase or decrease the opacity like that. And hit save. Now as you can see that it looks great. Now we're gonna create some more variants of this fog sheet. So I'm gonna open the content browser again. And I'm gonna duplicate this fog material like that. And double click to open this right here. Dock this layout right here. Now again in the fog material editor we're gonna add some noise textures. To add noise textures just open the content browser and here you can see the engine folder right here. If you don't see the engine folder right here just go to settings and click on this show engine content. It should be unselected so you can uh, enable this right here from show engine content like that. After that open the engine right here and search noise now scroll down a little bit 
now at the end you can see this dialing noise 05 i'm gonna use this one you can also use other if you want to create more variants like this one dialing noise 01 and also this one so i'm gonna go with the dialing noise 05 just drag and drop this right here now let's just add multiply node and plug this right here and this one right here and output in the opacity now as you can see that we have some variants just apply it in the fog material we can see that we have this fog one just right click and create material instance like that by selecting the material instance change the fog from here as you can see that we have now the noise pattern here if you see those hard edges you can fix them just double click to open it like that and increase the fade distance like that you can also increase or decrease the opacity if you want as you can see it looks great now we can also animate the fog for that just go to the material editor again and here we're gonna just animate the uvs of this texture sample now it is really easy to do just right click and search panner right here plug the panner in the uvs and here we just need to animate the speed of this panner node now to control or animate the speed just add parameter hold as left mouse click and name it speed and plug it right here now for the default value i'm gonna give it something like one now as you can see the speed looks really fast first apply it and see it in the real world as you can see that it looks so fast so we're gonna slow it something like 0 0.01 As you can see it looks great so you can create multiple variants if you want that's it for today's tutorial make sure to share this technique and subscribe to my channel